Hey you guys, welcome back. It is Saturday and we have been working so hard. Hi Ashley. Yeah. You wanna come in and get in? Where are you? Where are you? It is 1.20 and we have been working on our entire house. Actually, we've been mainly working upstairs at cleaning. That is the day we normally do cleaning, but we're not only cleaning for a normal Saturday to get ready for Sunday and the week, but we're also cleaning for our trip. Right, Chelsea? She just came downstairs. We are cleaning for a birthday party for Kaylee. She's having that today and tonight. So she wanted to make sure everything was done. You guys, she had her normal Saturday chores done by eight o'clock this morning. She had swept them up the floors by 7.30 this morning down here and then upstairs she had done the bathroom by eight. By 8.15 she was asking me if she could get her carry-on bag packed, which meant that she was cleaning her bedroom. So. The, there's a whole lot of motivation going on around here. I was so happy with my kids. Mm -hmm. We're going to take you around and show you all the things that we cleaned. Ashley and Chelsea want to show you their room. Right, girls? I'm and then I'm going to treat them to a kid's meal. Does that sound like a good deal? Yeah. Okay, Ashley wants to show you to her room. I'm going to show you around here downstairs really quick, and then she wants to take you upstairs. Okay, so down here we didn't have to do much. Abby, you want to say hi? Abby was kind of my right-hand man this morning. She did a ton of work upstairs with me organizing. There wasn't much mess down here because we didn't have much for breakfast. We just did cereal for breakfast. Right, Chels? Mm -hmm. But the kitchen is clean in here. Did regular chores down here. There is two loads of laundry going in the laundry room. And we just have our shoes that we're going to put on. Those are the ones that are out here. And then this room is all cleaned up. That is the science project that Jason is going to do with Kaylee. So they're going to work on that tonight. So the front room is all cleaned up. And then my study is all clean for me to work in as soon as we get home this afternoon. And not that tidy. tonight, not that tidy. it's not that tidy. That's dad's mess. He works for his brother and does some packaging for his product. So that is Jason's mess. Okay, girl. <laughs> do you want to go show him your room? Yes, I never got to hold the new camera. You haven't gotten to hold the new camera? No. We just we yeah. just got a new camera, right, yeah. Ash? So she got a, we got a new vlogging camera, so she wants to show you her we room. Like being like using the phone. No, we don't have to use my phone anymore, huh? Yeah. Okay, let's go show him your room. Let's go in my room. Bed. Got oh. our beds cleaned. But Chelsea has Chelsea's bedroom cleaned. My bed. And then Ashley uses her mermaid tail sleeping bag on top of her bed, mm. right? Yeah. Okay, now let's kind of got all your books organized. Yeah. Right? Okay, now let's back up. Show them your little bench was all cleaned up. And you have your robes all hung up, right? Yep. Yep. Okay, now and did you clean off your desk? Yeah. Okay, tell them about your little stuff over here. Uh, so we have pens. These are all pens. Mm-hmm. Makeup. Okay. Oh, is that for play makeup? No, real makeup. It's real makeup, and Kaylee does your makeup sometimes, huh? Yeah, but sometimes we do it. Yep. Okay, then what do we have? So Chelsea is um, from church, she's planting a plant, and I have a plant, but it's downstairs. Mm -hmm. And brown, like smell of his. Mm -hmm, that's dirt. All right, so you got some more pens and knickknacks. And stamps. Yep, stamps. And then you got a little dish with all your other stuff in it. And then these are your calendars, right? So, wait. What's today? Wait, no. Oh, we have to do a couple. We have to do a couple. We have to do a couple more. Wait, this is today. No, because we also have Sunday. This is the 30th and the 31st. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And tomorrow is going to be <sighs> April Fool's Day. So do you like your room to be all nice and clean? Yeah. Alright, should we go show them Kaylee and Abby's room? Yes, 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 yes. All right, Kaylee and Abby did their bedroom. And they did it really good. They pot. dusted and they cleared off this table. Uh, pocket knife. Oh, that's okay. That's their pocket knife. And then Kaylee made her bed. Oh, here we can put this chair back at their makeup table. 
right? So she's got her whole windowsill cleaned off. And a big giant. Her little stuffy. All her blankets are folded underneath here. You can tell her friends are coming over because she got it all cleaned up. Abby dusted up here. She got all of her, <laughs> this is insane. Abby, you're so cute. She got all of her earrings. Oh my gosh, I haven't seen this. Look how cute that is. She got all of her stuff organized. Those are her earrings. Her closet's all cleaned out. And the pictures of killing her. Her shoes down here. She's an organized kid. Oh, there's an extra t-shirt down there. So let's go show them the rest of the house before this battery dies, okay? <gasps> all right, so the playroom is all clean. I love that kids get to play, but I love a clean playroom, right? They actually tumble in here more than they play with toys, so this is perfect, yep. So we're in our room. My room is clean and dusted, and look, we don't have Star Wars Legos on top of my dresser anymore. Jason doesn't know that yet. We'll see how long it takes him to realize that they're gone and where they're at. I'll show you guys. So we've got our room all packed up, plus here's a sneak peek. What's coming next week? We are getting our bags packed, ready to go. I can show you everything, because those videos are coming soon. So we've got the Lego area kind of all cleaned up. I vacuumed the entire house, and guess whose Legos got a new display case over here. So I put one or two down there, and then we put one up here. Actually, there's a Star Wars one there, a Star Wars, and then we have the Great Wall of China. We got that from Jason's sister, who even, um, is living in China right now. Even, uh, she, they sent us a picture. They got a lot, so they made a big, giant wall of it. Yeah. It's it, pretty cool, huh? All right, so my battery is about to die. I'm going to take the kids to go get some lunch. And Kaylee's having a birthday party tonight. I'm not sure how much she wants me to film of that. And I don't want to film other kids, because I don't have permission to. But we'll take you on the rest of our day that we have as a family, and whatever we do. So should we go get kids meals? It feels so good to be cleaned up. The house is all clean. I'm gonna try and maintain this all week long to get ready for travel and not have major messes to clean up next weekend. And you guys, I have makeup on on a Saturday. Like that doesn't happen. So I'm excited to be all dressed and clean. I shaved my face. <laughs> It, it was a whole, I mean, everything got clean, even the window wells. So we did a lot today. So time to go and get some food. Right, Ash? Maybe I'll go get a Cafe Rio instead of McDonald's and let them have kids meals. We'll see. Okay, let's go get lunch. Okay, I have to show this on camera. I've shown this on my Instagram. This is all a creation by Abby. So stinking cute. She's been doing a countdown for our trip. I mean, look at the detail. She did the water with an island and a palm tree with coconut and then a beach ball and then the sun shining up there. And it says it's seven days. Seven more days. And tomorrow's gonna be eight more days. No, no count down. Six <laughs> Silly girl. Okay, let's go get lunch. Very good. I don't know, we gotta keep cutting them out. And you gotta follow oh, the see the big bear? You gotta cut the bear out. Yeah, he must be going in somewhere. Chelsea's got it. Look at Chelsea's. It's kinda like you're folding the paper airplane. Yeah. <laughs> no, hello, how are you doing? Hi, how are you? <laughs> Thank you. Instead of you just say, do you have any food? Hi. Hi. <laughs> I have. They have leftovers. You can ask if they want to give you her, their so leftovers. Chelsea said I could have her cheeseburger. Do you want it right now? Yeah. I can't see your face now. It's on the back seat. Um, Are you getting fed? Mm-hmm. All right, and then I'm going to come and get you, or you're going to come home in just a little while, and I will take you and get Harmony, right? All right, they suckered me into staying at the park with him for a minute. So we'll go in. This is the only way I'm gonna be able to get pictures of Kaylee while she's out and about. He says she's playing with her little sisters. Sometimes she'll let me film her, so we'll see if she lets me do this. Plus, it's kind of cool to have this camera now. Her friend kind of is digging it, so let's see what I can get. Uh, this is a little backward, don't you think? <laughs> no, not. No? No, it's not. We're the little kids, we're the big kids now. They're the hey, master manipulators, then. <laughs> Kaylee, get off that swing, give it me. <laughs> yeah, now Chelsea, we get to have fun. <laughs> okay, yeah. Come on, give me my phone. If they're the big kids, Kaylee can give up her phone. Now is not when we get our
Okay, I'm going home. What time are we going, Kaylee? Like 3.30? Okay, come home when you're ready to go. Oh my gosh, you guys are like typical teenagers. You're like zoned out, sitting with your phones. Okay, I'll see you at home. All right, you guys. I don't know if you can hear. It's about to get crazy in here. I don't know if I'm gonna feel much more. Maybe what I do and me and the other two kids. I have my sister-in-law actually who's gonna come over and take Chelsea and Ashley to the park to ride bikes, but I gotta stick around here while <laughs> the mayhem ensues. And there's only three teenagers here so far, but there's gonna be upwards of eight or 10 throughout the night. So if I can come out of this alive, you know, that'd be great. So we'll see what else we film today. All right, so all these kids came over and I don't know how many there are. Do you know how many there are, Abby? I don't know. Anyway, they came over and I was starting to get the cups out like Abby's got over there and I've got a popcorn bowl and some plates. Jason's gonna pick up pizza. And then we realized, oh crap, we don't have a birthday cake. I'm totally like, dropped the ball. It's totally my fault. I, Kaylee kind of sprung this birthday party on me like, what, like a week ago? Not very long ago. Last week ago. Yeah, like on Tuesday? Tuesday or Wednesday, and then just invited all these friends, including boys. And I'm trying to pack to like go out of town and clean the house and plan for their actual birthdays. So I just got to show right now and I realized I don't even have a birthday cake for this party and I barely have like food. Have eggs. This is yeah, so anyway, and I don't have eggs. And I can't leave, they're at the park, but like I can't leave because if they come back home, then they're gonna be unattended. And even though I trust Kaylee at the age of 14 now um, There's boys here, so I can't I can't there's no, no way man not gonna trust that they might be coming I'm back um, I'm gonna go see if the neighbor has an egg hang on all right, so our neighbor saved the day right Abby Yeah, we got two eggs out of three. We're gonna hopefully I see if this We'll just see if this works We'll see if it liquefies to the right state did you already add the water or the whatever? Water. Okay, so we'll have a birthday cake here soon. We'll be, we'll, we'll be back in touch with you guys. All right, so I'll show you the evidence of half the party so far. This is our makeshift cake. It is not, and by any means, something I'm proud of. Abby decorated it. She did a good job. It's all why it worked out. I, they know. So I'm just taking you around. We've got some pizza left, and I think the boys are still starving. They've already eaten two pizzas. This is kind of. They just kind of all went to the park. Jason just got home. He saved the day with the pizza, so I didn't have to leave them alone. Anyway, they all went to the park, and then they're gonna come back and have cake, and I don't even have a, I, enough ice cream, I don't think, and popcorn, that's what I've got. So they're gonna watch, same as we watched last night. Ralph wrecks the internet. Ralph wrecks the internet. She said the, they like to watch cartoons, so <laughs> I don't care. It actually makes it easier for me. I don't have to like, moderate and make sure the movie is, you know, kid worthy. Uh, I'm hoping they settle down and watch this movie and we can get the other kids in bed. They say they're bored because they're not getting any attention <laughs> this afternoon. So Abby has a project for them upstairs. I'm hoping they're making a little sign for their bus driver because we're hoping she comes back to school next week because she hurt her back in a car accident with, well, a bus accident with the car during all the snow here in Seattle. She's been out of work for three weeks on medical leave and we're just hoping she's back because she's the kid's like best friend. <laughs> she's so awesome and the kids are so looking forward to her being back. So I think they're making a banner for her in case she comes back on Monday. So that's where we're at. We will see how the day goes. All right, so we're getting things all prepped for their movie, right Chelsea? Yup. We got popcorn. What, what number are we on, Abby? One, two, three, four. Fourth bag of popcorn. We have two more. Man, these kids eat tons. And then we've got our cake. I kind of wanted to throw some sprinkles on there and try and fancy it up a little bit, but. Kaylee hates sprinkles. Yep. <laughs> Apparently she doesn't like sprinkles. It's crunchy and nice. I like it. I know. So certain sprinkles are okay. We've got the little bowls for popcorn. And then we've got some plates and the forks for and the cake. And we've got matches, but you can't light it yet, girl. Can I do it though? And then we have some leftover pizza because I think the boys weren't quite full, but I wanted to make sure I got a piece. 
I'm just gonna be honest. We're just kind of waiting. I'm gonna give them another 10 minutes or so at the park, kind of get out their energy and whatnot while we kind of get the rest of this popcorn made. And they're gonna watch their movie and hopefully it can be quiet for a bit. But that's what we're doing. And then these guys need to go to bed. I'm yeah, sorry to say. Much. You were up till 10 o'clock last night watching the movie that they're watching tonight. If you want 15 minutes of screen time, you're not gonna give me that face anymore. Don't smile. That You can't just change your face to that. Chelsea. You not smile <laughs> I all knew the you. time. And then I, if I do that face because you say not to smile. It's so called sarcasm, <laughs> Goob. No. Okay, so are you gonna get pajamas on, teeth brushed, so that you can have, oh. I don't know. Did you just spill popcorn everywhere? Yeah, I don't know what I was I don't either. Okay, Chelsea, I want pajamas on, teeth brushed, face washed, and then you may have 15 minutes of screen time after you read. Here, Ashley, the popcorn. Okay? Go. <laughs> Ashley, did you hear that? Ashley, yeah, but can I have taste? Oh, yeah, so go get your pajamas on. They're like downing as much of this as they can. Because they know they have to go to bed. I need you to get your pajamas on. Okay? Go. We'll see how this night goes. This is my first, like, boy-girl party. And once these lights are out and the movie is on, I am going to be here like a hawk. I'm right going to be right in the next door with my room light on. The door open. open. And we're going to pop in unexpectedly every it so often. The, the popcorn opened in the microwave? Yes. Oh dear, we're in our last box, or our last bag of popcorn, and it kind of exploded Seven in the class, kitchen. It exploded in the microwave, I mean. <laughs> it's, I'm tired. All right, got our popcorn and our little dishes, and then the cake plates. Already, we just need the kids. I think I'm gonna call them home.